Just after midnight in this quiet Pimpama street, Shane Bowden was shot dead outside his own home. He's basically driven into his driveway, hadn't even got out of his car and he's been executed. Police say the 48-year-old was ambushed, returning from the gym. His partner and her two children were home at the time. It's a matter that would appear to be within the one club, I would suggest, as opposed to one club against another. Neighbours heard the drama unfold. Like I said, I thought it was gunshots, but then, you know, I was like, oh, it can't be, obviously. Um, it's a neighbourhood and surely it wasn't. Mm. Went back to sleep and then woke up about an hour and a half, two hours later to police knocking on the door telling me there'd been a gunshot. Police say there's no threat to the general public and it's too early to tell if retaliation is on the cards. But Mr Bowden's mates made an early visit to the scene, breaking police lines. Just well, we just brother. Yeah. We've just had a mate die. Have some respect. Mr Bowden was charged last month after allegedly breaching Queensland border restrictions. He was rushed from his quarantine hotel to a Gold Coast hospital for treatment on an infected gunshot wound to his leg, reportedly inflicted in a drive-by shooting in Melbourne. They don't take fluffy toys to hospitals and stuff like that. These are criminal gangs that survive on retribution, violence and threats. In 2008, Mr Bowden was sentenced to six and a half years jail for his role in a notorious 2006 brawl between the Finks and Hell's Angels bikey gangs on the Gold Coast. The ballroom blitz brawl left multiple men shot or stabbed and caused thousands of dollars worth of damage. The street where the shooting unfolded is covered by high-definition CCTV. Police have seized the vision and are now searching for two men who were at the scene, one in dark clothing and one in light. They're also looking at other leads. Two burnout cars located tonight, uh, one at Bean Lee and one at Ormo, and uh, we're certainly looking at the connections between those two vehicles and the, and the murder of this gentleman. Police have confirmed Mr Bowden was a member of the Finks Motorcycle Club after patching over from the Mongols. Jennifer Huxley, ABC News, Gold Coast.